Hello there, Matthew here. I'm uh, going to do a couple quick unboxings today. I decided to bundle these two together. Um, and really fast, I'm going to be unboxing a music stand, a Musician's Gear Deluxe Conductor music stand. I picked this one up. Uh, you could probably pick it up off of Amazon for around $30, $27-$30. And it's got four point eight out of five stars there. So it got really good reviews. It's, it looked really solid, so I'm about to check it out. And then I also got um, something to screw on to the music stand. And it's called it's um it's by a company called Viz. Kaya, and it's called VLH110 Violin Hinge with Bow Peg Attachment. So I'm going to go ahead and um, open this, the stand first, and then open the attachment. And a real quick note about the attachment, you could buy either one for around 9 bucks, two for 10 50 three for 12 bucks. So I went ahead and bought three. For 12 bucks. Um, we'll see if I'll actually use all three, but um, I figure I might as well just pay an extra, extra buck or two and get three. Alright. Okay, so let me get to unboxing the music stand first. says conductor stand on the box here. Feels like he's got a good weight to it. As you can see I'm coming from this thing and this stand has seen better days. It just the way it just tilts, like it doesn't, it doesn't level right. So I was like, I have to get a new stand. All right, so ooh, this thing's solid. As far as down here, made in China, musician gear. Now really, it says conductor music stand, but I figure it would work just as well for somebody who's playing an instrument. All right, very simple, straightforward. Solid, solid frame there. This thing's solid. It looks like it. Um, everything just tightens with these these nuts right here. It's like there's a hinge here. You can adjust it. And it looks like it will tighten onto here. You can see I'm just tight tightening it up in the back here. Now, I assume you want this one tight and this one you want tight but not as tight so you can adjust it if you need to. Just like that. Alright, so you can see it. I don't know if you can see it. 
but the back is solid black. The bars are solid black, and then it's like a, a metal, non-painted bolts, four metal bolts there. But they, they seem sturdy on there, so that's good. So yeah, tighten it. It doesn't move. It's solid. So let me go ahead and... Move this stuff. Get rid of this guy. Yeah, you know, not get rid of it, but keep it, keep it for traveling, that type of thing. Oh yeah. This is solid. Put that on there. Alright, so that's the unboxing of the music stand. I mean, it's solid. I think this is uh, money well spent. I think this is going to last a good while. Alright, so this is the unboxing of the music stands here, or the uh, violin stands. I uncut it already there. They says open it up, <clears throat> and there's three of these boxes. I said um, one of these was nine dollars, two of these is ten fifty, and three of these is twelve bucks. So I just opted for the t three option. Okay. Now it says excellent customer service here, 100% satisfaction guarantee. And then <clears throat> that's all that's in the box. Everything is right here. So when I look in here, in this bag here, there's this plastic piece, which I really hope it doesn't do anything because it doesn't seem like it fits on anything. So I'm just going to set it aside. Got this right here. And it looks like, according to the picture, there's no instructions, but you just screw the end here. And now it says on the back that you could clamp it to this side or this side. It doesn't really matter. I don't know if you can see. I just have my violins leaning against the wall. So hopefully um, this will make it look a little nicer in here, you know? I think it's to be nice. You gotta open it pretty wide. You can see there's going to be a limit to how big of a, of a space it has. It says it can fit up to one inch. I believe this is one inch, so let's find out. Oh! I don't know if we have a match. Let's see. Not looking too good. Let's try this. Ah, nice. All 
right, it looks like that's going to fit just nice. Perfect size. Obviously, you're going to want to leave a little room for the top of the violin there. Ah, there it is. Because it said uh, in the description on Amazon that the pegs don't actually sit on there. And if you see, the back of the violin here is designed in such a way that it sets on the rubber there. I don't know if you can see that, but it is indeed not leaning on the pegs. All right, I like that. Let's see, let's put this here. Seems okay. Okay. So it isn't touching the violin. It isn't actually touching. The bow fits on there just fine. It's off the ground and it's not touching the violin. So that works out pretty well. Sweet. All right, so my violin is off the floor. Look at that. Oh, yeah. All right. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm just trying to. Um, Personally, I'm get, trying to get back into music. I used to play violin a few years in high school. And, um, you know, as I acquire more things for the violin, I would like to share it with everybody. And um, if you look in uh, the description below, you'll see some uh, affiliate links to Amazon. So go ahead and check that out. You can read some reviews and, um, you know, get the idea of the current price Prices generally fluctuate on Amazon, so just go ahead and uh, check them out. And um, thanks for watching.